I'm J.R. Carter. I play uh, James Marks, special agent. And uh, let's see, who's James Marks? I'm the boss for uh, the uh, organization. Kind of like the conscience, if you will, of the younger characters. Keeping them focused, keeping them, you know, on track. And also, you know you need a wildcat, but you also need somebody to keep, to calm them down. I'm a calming factor in the film. When I first read it, I was totally impressed. I was blown away. You know, like you read stuff and you go, eh, that's okay, that's okay. I kept getting more and more caught up, more and more caught up. I intended to read it in parts. I read the entire film straight through. I was that impressed with it. I had a, I had a lot of uh, background in this kind of work, so it was a little easy for me. But different being the boss, and also trying to follow uh, Andre's direction as far as keeping the character as cool as possible, so like a Edward James almost kind of a character, and trying to keep that voice and keeping that whole the flow. As a director, I am amazed by this guy. This guy is so young and he's doing so much, and I'm like, I don't know how it's happening. I, it's like, how is this guy not in Hollywood? How is this guy not making huge, huge films already? I find every time I work very rewarding. I constantly learn, and I also kind of, from this film, I got re-energized. I fell in love all over again with acting, with the film process, because I had stopped doing film for a while, I was doing TV for a long time, and doing film, I fell in love all over again, and that's why you keep doing this. No one makes you act, you know, you love it. You have to love it to do it, and I fell in love all over again. It's a, it's a long love affair.